Hello, my name is Victor Feynman. I am a solutions architect with Amazon Web Services. In this video, I will show you how to use IAM Access Analyzer policy generation to generate fine-grained IAM policies that help you set the right permissions and adhere to the principles of least privilege. Creating least privilege policies can be tough, but did you know AWS Access Analyzer can help with that? IAM Access Analyzer Policy Generation is a feature that will create fine-grained policies based on access activity. It works by analyzing CloudTrail logs in your account to identify actions and services used during the specified period of time. You can confidently use IAM Access Analyzer Policy Generation to intelligently and quickly generate least privileged policies in a broad set of workload scenarios. Speaking of scenarios, we found this to be extremely useful during rapid application development. Development teams can define broad, overly permissive policies in order to develop faster with fewer roadblocks. Then, use IAM Access Analyzer policy generation before deploying to production for your least privileged access policy. Using IAM Access Analyzer policy generation boils down to four simple steps. Request, review, refine, and create. So let's take a look at the process of generating a policy. Request. In this step, you will first need to navigate to the user or role you would like Access Analyzer to generate a policy for. Once on the desired role, find and click the Generate Policy button. Specify the time period, regional location, and name of the trail you want to analyze. If you want to analyze an AWS organization's managed cloud trail, additional configuration is required and can be found at the Learn More link. Select the desired regions and the service role to use. If a service role has not already been created, you or your administrator will need to create an Access Analyzer service role, which may be done in this step. The service role needs to access the trail, generate and get IAM service access details, get object and list bucket for the S3 bucket where CloudTrail events are delivered, and if the bucket is configured to use AWS Key Management Service for server-side encryption, the service role will need to call decrypt on the bucket KMS key. Once a role has already been created, you can use the same role for future policy generation requests. Lastly, select Generate Policy. This can take a few minutes based on the chosen date range and account activity. Then review. On this step, a policy has been generated and ready for review. Hit the View Generated Policy link to see the list of services and actions used by the IAM user or role. On this step, you should add actions based on your knowledge of the workload's current and or future needs. Once finished, reviewing and adding additional actions, proceed to the next step, Refine. IAM Access Analyzer Policy Generation does not have resource level information available, nor should it be presumptuous in assigning specific resources in the generated policies, as you may take this policy and parameterize it for IAC deployments in multiple environments. That's why, in this step, you will need to specify the resources within the resource properties of the generated policy. Fortunately, policy generation populates resource properties with a relevant tokenized string, so you need only to replace tokens with actual values. And finally, create. On this step, do a final review of the generated policy. As you can see, the name and description is pre-filled with good contextual information. Once satisfied, hit the Create and Attach Policy button. As is best practice, in order to not risk loss of functionality, always attach new policies before removing existing policies. 
Now, with your new policy attached, you can remove existing overly permissive policies. And that is it. It is that simple. Now, for the best part. As if auto-generated, fine-grained, least privileged policies isn't the best part, the IAM Access Analyzer policy generation feature is available to you at no additional cost. That just about wraps it up. I hope you have enjoyed this demo of IAM Access Analyzer policy generation.